how to. So there are two types of green screen footage color graded green screen non-color graded green screen we're gonna i'm gonna show you both how to how to remove green screen or have mercy i'm about to butt. you open the venture resolve you just you know create a new project and, um green screen removal do tutorial let's create it first you gotta do is we're gonna start with the color graded footage so we get, just gotta do is you come to edit amazing nice now you just uh, drag and drop the clip so i mean for you if imagine you like this is your main footage and after over that you want to put the green screen so yeah yeah you can just put it like that here like you can see there is no audio here so what i'm gonna do is just simply i'm gonna just double click it it's just gonna get only the video file over it like this but i want to just remove the green screen just basically make sure your effects are on like you just make sure this is on and then you just go to search bar search for 3d uh key something like that well you'll be like oh there is nothing because it's like title selected you just select toolbox oh there's nothing in here open effects yeah so you select open effects search 3d key keyer and then you find this you just select and drop it over here now once you drop it you go to inspector and i'll be like what the fuck i cannot see the inspector just turn on turn on you can just do like that now okay so come to inspector select effects and under effects you will see a 3d keyer option like this select this paint icon like this and now you come here you select this and then make it to open effects overlay nice make sure you just do that so you select it make sure this is open effects overlay and just simply you just left click and draw a little bit like like this and boom all the green shit is just gone oh crane look at that those green things are there don't worry about that that's why you just come to inspector and you see this dispel option you just increase it increase it unless it just you know you get a nice little thing but now if you increase too much dispel like the footage will go a little bit yellowish and all that stuff so you have to keep that in mind increase the dispel for this footage nothing significantly happening so like that okay okay so oh my god christian bale amazing oh geez and like that so you get the idea how the the the, 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 the that thing works let's bring our holy mcguire here let's take oh spider man gonna cry gonna cry and then you'll be like oh do i have to like do select do all that stuff like just you know put 3d gear on this open fx overlay paint it all that stuff no you don't need to once you make one one footage ready like that you can just simply you know just select it Control c you come to the second footage select it alt v and then it pops up this thing so we're gonna just select plugins that's basically the effect and that's it you just hit apply and then it's applied take this put it on here you put a 3d gear upon it you 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 go to effects and you just select it and <laughs> so you cannot use 3d gear here first we have to color grade it now just don't freak your brain okay you have to go to the color grade page just select color page just come to the color page you don't need to get scared or anything because anything you cannot see probably is like turned off on you know all that stuff that's it so be like what the hell is this and what the hell daddy chill what the hell what we're gonna do is we're gonna right click on it add node we're gonna add a parallel node now this thing is all sought from my gopro and i just put it in there so now you you have two nodes you, you call the this boxes node okay the, look at this 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 type of problem happens it's super frustrating so i didn't do anything this node went black it went just it, so this is disable mode so you control d it to enable it that's thing it happens all the time i'm telling you just it was frustrated so you select this upper uh node and then you come to this uh picker icon and then you just select make sure you select this one and then you just hold left click and just paint the green okay like this like this like this now when, when you do it you just see here it's kind of shows like an outline over outline that it took some green out of it now you can see this this is the lighting issue that happens 
you know that's why you need to like proper light to do the green screen stuff so the, because the lighting issue is just kind of like reflective and like became yellow this part so that part need to be fixed so for that we're gonna do is we're gonna just select this add one and we're gonna kind of try to put this on it never mind now this is just make a rough icon you know you can do that you cannot do that it's on you we're just gonna control z it we're just gonna leave it basic raw like this and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna come to gain and just left click and put this all the way to green here first you you put it on the green thing and it's, it'll look like this i'm like what the garbage it looks like now you, you increase the gain start increasing the gain and it will start be doing looking like this now it's a good uh, place to start with now you can see all this you know kind of uh, poor lighting caused this weird kind of stuff so now you select this plus icon and now you can you just left click it what i did just just left click it i mean left click and drag it a little bit and boom it's gone now also this this is gone most of that most of that is gone now that's i mess around with only the gain now if you cannot see this gain and all that stuff you basically make sure you just uh, under you know here over here so that's it now offset you increase the offset a little bit what makes it a little bit this thing more you know greenish all that stuff you can mess around with the gamma so then you know just decrease this thing you maybe lift a bit so then that thing but also you know it depends upon like i want my hair to be like a uh, little bit of visible in the green screen so like if i put the uh, lift too much my it's just clipping my uh, hair and stuff so like i'm gonna keep it little low profile because it's gonna work i'm gonna crop this part anyway okay we converted this like if i control d it okay this was it was before and now it's after but still if you zoom it you can see my face it's such a poorly color graded like i have to still color grade it now it's the time to do it uh so you just select the blower node now we're gonna do a little bit of color grade so it's just like basically i'm gonna increase the brightness a bit you see there uh we're gonna decrease the offset a bit increase the contrast a bit and that's it we do before after turn off this node you see see this uh your my face is such a dark god that sounds so sus meow, meow, ne yeah and now i after color grade if you turn it on look at this it's so it's basically color graded <laughs> now you go back to edit page and then you just again doing the same thing 3d gear put it on there come to effects you select this and you make sure oh, this shit is on okay and you just start painting look at this now you just start doing it up to this point like this like this like this as much as you can like this and you get uh, this type of result apparently where it's just the green is over there so we're gonna just simply uh dispel it right there boom a uh, little bit of despeel it's like around 48 that, that that actually cuts out anything greenish greenish thing you know for some time it was a very poor they're gonna be yellow yellow stuff laying around there you have to go to the key adjustment and then you have to mess around with the key chroma tolerance you mess around like this look at this if chroma tolerance was very less it would have been looked like this garbage but then if you just increase it 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 cuts out everything basically these two are <laughs> what the fuck? You can mess around with all the settings, but most of the time, if you have shot a good green screen footage or like just like me, you 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 would end it up with this something like this. Uh, that's it. So just to let you know, there are other ways to remove green screen. There are a couple other ways from fusion. You could have done it from color, like, but that have a lot of different problems. <laughs> Thanks for watching, brother. Take care of yourself. Be proud of yourself. Just breathe. <sighs> no cocaine, though. Hey, yo, oh, yo. How to. Crazy!